Happy Friday, everybody. Old man winter showing up to crash the party this weekend. Here's what we're tracking. Weekend weather for field work. <laughs> It's just not going to happen this weekend. Here's kind of a look at what we're looking at as this storm moves in. So today we're going to see some rain, primarily some mountain snow. That's going to turn to snow on Saturday. Heavy snow and a significant amount of accumulation likely as Sunday rolls around. Here's the likelihood of seeing over a foot of accumulation. It's primarily going to be right in the vicinity of the Rocky Mountain front. That could touch into Gray Falls, maybe even Haver, but we should see about, I would say, eight inches or so for most of Gray Falls. A lot of that is going to depend on how quickly the rain transitions over to snow. All right, the driving force behind this continuing to impact us this weekend. Area of low pressure is going to continue to pull that Pacific moisture across the state. Widespread flurries are expected on Sunday. That's when we'll see the greatest accumulations. That will take us into Monday. System loses some strength finally by Monday afternoon, making way for more sunshine and a little bit more mild weather once Tuesday, Wednesday rolls around, but still rather chilly. And again, significant snow accumulations. You don't need me to tell you all the livestock impacts we're going to be looking at a lot of tree branches, very wet and heavy snow, so a lot of down tree branches. And keep in mind, we'll likely see greater snow accumulations on grassy areas and vegetation areas as well. So just kind of keep that in mind. So rain moves in today, turning to snow on Saturday. Wet and heavy snow expected through Monday. Hunker down. Have a great weekend, everybody.